Hello and welcome to the video. In today's video, we are going to be ranking the early Cretaceous pack from worst to best. Now, this is my own opinion, as I like to point out, so if you have a different opinion, that is perfectly fine. Anyway, let us get into it. So, in number four, and in my opinion, the weakest edition is Warasaurus. Now, before I get before anyone gets mad, this is not based on the dinosaur. This is based on the design. And the design of Warasaurus is really good. And honestly, I think the early Cretaceous pack is the best DLC we've had so far. At least excluding, like, pack, in front of packs. DLC in general, probably Dominion, but packs... Uh, this is a close second, in my opinion. But that's not the point. Um, this DLC is so good that it's difficult to give one of these creatures um, a low ranking. Um, because it feels wrong, because they're all really good. But... As well as I said, Warasaurus was probably the one I used the least. Um, doesn't mean it's a bad Stegosaur. In fact, out of all the Stegosaurs, I use it one of the most. I just don't use Stegosaurs that often. And if I do, it's usually Stego. Maybe some of the time I'll use Hyangosaur, but that's a push. Um, uh, I do like the design, genuinely. It's a good design. It's just a bit like... Um, oh, it's difficult, because the design is really nice. I think over time I've started to like the eyebrows a bit less. Um, but apart from that, it's just the weakest, unfortunately. Um, aside from that, if you, this is your favourite, by the way, it's fine, I completely understand. But this DLC is so good that it's difficult to be mean to any of them. Um, anyway. Moving onwards. The second weakest, and this one might be a little bit more controversial, is the Jasunga Ruptress. Now, I do not dislike this creature at all. In fact, honestly, out of all the pterosaurs, it's probably one of my most used. Um, and that just shows the quality of this DLC, that one of my most used pterosaurs is, like, second worst. And that's not a dislike to Dusser and Goripterus. I think the design's really good. It's, like, an 8 out of 10. I give Warasaur 7.5, by the way. But the issue with Dusser and Goripterus is mainly um, the pattern, if I'm being honest. I think the pattern's a little bit bland on all the pterosaurs. The only one that does the exception to is Quetzal. Um, but the pattern on this guy is not great. I like the crest, the crest design's awesome, but the pan itself is not great, and that's what holds it back in my opinion. Uh, apart from that, it's a really good design. But anyway, now, number two, this is possibly my favourite herbivore in the game, this is the Minmi. Now, Minmi, in my opinion, is a top five creature and in this game, and that is just my opinion, obviously you do not have to agree with it. I love the Minmi in this game, it is like a solid... 9.5 and this just shows the quality because two of what one of the creatures which i value to be top five best is not even first um which just shows um but anyway enough of that i think you all know which is number one and that is mr chronosaurus if i can pass him yes okay now any Walking With Dinosaurs OG fans will understand. Um, just If you've seen Walking With Dinosaurs in general, you'd understand. But this pan is fucking awesome. It's just really cool to have, like, a, you know, dinosaur, uh, sorry, a creep, uh, sorry, like, a thing that looks similar to the Walking Dinosaurs, like, Lara Pluridon. It's not perfect, but it looks good. Um, apart, apart from that, the uh, Chronosaurus is one of the two creatures that can eat a shark feeder. In my opinion, the animation is much cooler. Uh, the Mosasaurs, it's possible, it's it's easily my favourite aquatic creature in the game. Um, and in general, honestly, Chronosaurus is awesome. The fun thing about Chronosaurus, if you don't know, by the way, in real life, apparently now it's a dubious genus, because um, I think one of the species that like we thought Chronosaurus to be, um, as I'm not going to get into it too far, but I think like one of the species is now classified as a different uh, animal entirely. And so Chronosaurus is actually a bit dubious now, which is funny, <laughs> in my opinion. But that's just my opinion. I know. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, uh, subscribe, and um, that's about it.